You're recording, are you? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, you see these two trees here? Maybe, the ones across the road, maybe you might remember about 10, 12 years ago, I had a little uh, quadcopter that I'd made and I was flying it around in between those two trees. Well, that's where it is, and it's about 10 years old, and those trees ain't little no more. But they were two little stubby things, and they were quite big. All right, the other story. Um, I crashed into one of those posts, sort of trying to do a touch and go on it, and um, I've just decided rather than change and fix this propeller, I'm going to fly it and see if you notice any difference. Uh, let's set this one to record. So I stuck in another 450MAH um, and we're just going to give it a little gentle welly round here. Set down in the nice. Right. So let's see if we notice any difference at all. Here. It's drifting off that way, I don't know if that's to do with, um, with the prop, but to be really honest with you, it feels exactly the same. Maybe there's a wobble. Maybe there is a little bit of a wobble now, a little bit more of a wobble. But, I mean, basically, we're five and a half props. Yeah, I think if you handed me the controls and said fly it, I wouldn't know that there was anything wrong. So yeah, it's absolutely fine on that. Now, we'll give you another quick joke. As we're walking past to come back to the car, you'll see two lads over there on a the bench, yeah? I heard... And I thought, hey, I recognise that sound, man. I know that sound. Uh, it's a drone of sorts, but I couldn't see nothing in their hands. So we carried on walking a little bit. And I'm looking up at the sky, looking for their drone. I can't see it. And then I see one of them pointing and looking. So I readjusted myself, walked around, and I could see this little DJI Mavic Mini. I have a Mavic Mini or Mini 2, right, um, he was struggling with it to be honest because it wasn't smooth, it was kind of jerky and I was thinking for the amount of wind that we got right now which is like, I don't know, 2 mile an hour, maybe if you look in the background you'll see him go again. Bright orange t-shirt. Yeah. Yeah. He won't even know that we've got a drone over here because ours is so much more quiet than his. But yeah, I thought, oh, he's struggling. Uh, so he must be quite new sort of thing, yeah? I could barely see it when it came into view. And then he hovered it in front of the trees. Ooh, nearly. He hovered it in front of the trees. And I thought, no, either come closer or go up because I can't see what you're doing and if I can't from your low advantage point I don't think you can either. So we watched him for a minute and the drone came down close enough and then he did a bit of flying around here. He was um, not necessarily practicing good drone safety I would say. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, because it was about eight, ten people out there in front of him and he was flying over them probably 15 metres high up uh, just flying straight over and I thought oh no, you're not going to be enjoying that 
that situation for too long. Uh, the missus said, well, they don't care because they're Polish. <laughs> no, it did not. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Okay, I lied a little bit there, right? Um, <coughs> but yeah, basically... We don't know they're Polish. We don't they're know Eastern nothing. European. Yeah. See, this is the more sedate line that Mazen was on his back. Great, so now I'm a brothel owner. No, 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 it can't be. You see, this is why you keep your mouth shut when you're flying, right? Because anyhow you don't and you mess up, then you're in the, you know? Bring it down a little bit. Just... You're hidden in the tree now. Am I? Am I? No, you're not now. Okay, I'm clear. Good, good, good. So when you come too far this side, this big one. Yeah. <coughs> but it also made me laugh watching them fly, thinking, yeah, I bet I was exactly the same as that years ago. Yeah. Now I could make more or less any drone I fancy like or look like it had DJI hardware in it or something, you know what I mean? And, um, and love it. But put the FPV goggles on and that's it, it's all gone to pop. I keep forgetting right to um to move the transmitter further away from the recorder. I feel like I always feel like this build is the best build ever. <laughs> right? When I make a tricopter sort build. Well, it's just learning each time, isn't it? You learn each yeah. time you do something. Yeah. Well, you'd rather dump that, but. Well, I did, didn't I? <laughs> I did a very bad job with that. But I, um, there's a strap protecting the lip eye, man. There it is my little hexacopter and that flight was done with half a prop missing just uh, so I could refresh my memory because I forgot <laughs> I forgot I didn't feel any difference I think that would be the main advantage of four I mean six sorry plus blades versus four that would be its main advantage if something goes a little bit wrong someone was to slingshot a propeller maybe you might not even know until you've landed that half a prop is missing whereas with a quad someone slingshot half a prop off and that's it you're coming down so yeah that might be its advantage um, as you can see my trusty 450 I've got 10 of these about yeah, I got 10 of these about three years ago. I'm on the first four still. 